Belle, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to talk about a brand that nobody seems to talk about all that much online, but should really talk about. The brand I'm talking about is Moreau Paris. Um, keep in mind though that I don't speak French. I never formally learned French, so if I'm mispronouncing this, my sincerest apologies. If you can teach me how to pronounce it, you can comment it down below. That would be very much appreciated. So, Moreau Paris. Now, I came across this brand for the first time in 2019, I think. So I was looking for a tote bag, and at that time, I was considering the Eau Tote by Moana. In the course of my research, I came across uh, this blog called The Leather Crafter at WordPress.com. I'm going to link her blog down below and learn about this brand for the very first time. So I'm actually quite a, a late adopter. But the history of Moreau goes all the way back to 1882. They're based in Paris and they're most known for their hand stitched all leather bags. If you're interested to take a look at all of their lines and offerings, I will leave the link down below on the description box. Okay, so I'm not gonna <laughs> keep this too long. So I do have four bags from Moreau, all of them coming from the same line called the Breganson. Sorry if I did not pronounce that correctly. Again, if you'd like to teach me how to pronounce that properly, <laughs> please do comment it down below. We'll start with the smallest ones that I have. So I do have two of their mini zip uh, Breganzon bags. This is, it still has the care card because I just got this, but um, we'll start with this one. So this is the mini zip in bull skin passion. So the colorway is passion. So a mini zip's dimension is 25 centimeters by 24 centimeters and seven centimeters. So each mini zip comes with uh, it looks like this inside. I currently have an organizer to give it some shape. So each mini zip comes with a detachable pouch. It looks like this. It's not zipped. It's just a, a slip pocket and a detachable adjustable strap. So here's a close-up. This is how it looks like. And then the bag itself sides. I really love the detail of the stitching. Like the really apparent stitching for me is, I love it. <laughs> I really do appreciate it. And one of the things that I absolutely love about the Breganzon, I, I'm not sure if it's the same for the other lines, but it must be, is that you can actually retract the handles which makes it a lot easier to store if you don't have a lot of storage room or, or if you like to pack this as an extra bag during a trip, you can just retract the, the handles and I'll show you later how you can fold it and you know store it in your carry-on or your check-in luggage and you know, you'll be able to save some space. So this is the, sorry, this is, a, this is again the, Mini Zip Breganzon in the colorway Passion. I'll show you the strap up close. So it's like this. And it's adjustable. There. And the Moreau tag there. Okay, so this is the iris one and again it's the same size it's i just got it so it has its original shape for now but as i said if you'd like to pack this as an extra bag during a trip you can retract the the handles and then fold the bag this way and put in your luggage isn't that amazing Okay, so for this one, uh, the inside looks like this. You can see the row there, and there's another one here as well. Here. And it also comes with the detachable pouch. 
detail. This also comes with a detachable adjustable strap. So it looks like this. Oh, oops, here. Okay, so again, these are my mini zip fragrance on. Both of these bags are made out of bull skin with goat skin lining. Now the next bag that we're going to talk about is my Bergenzon PM Zip and this is made out of bull skin as well with their printed leather on the sides as well as the inside which I'm going to show you in a little bit. So dimensions, um, 28 centimeters, 35 centimeters, and 14 centimeters. Okay, I have to just take out some stuff from here first. So this is in the Noir colorway with their printed um, leather on the sides as well as the inside. So this is made out of bull skin and just like the mini zip Bregançon, it comes with a detachable pouch. So up close, looks like this. I really love the stitching. It's, I love it. I appreciate it. I know it's not for everybody, but it certainly is for me. <laughs> okay, so the sides, the other side, at the bottom, it looks like this. And inside, again, it's their printed leather. The Moro, I don't know if you can see that. Oh, sorry. I don't know if you can see that right there. And the other side. And the pouch looks like this up close. The back. So it has a slip pocket at the back. And then this one looks like this. And you can just close it this way. You can retract the handles as well, and you can actually fold it. Sorry about that. <laughs> inwards. It'll look like this if you'd like to save some space. Okay. This is the PM zip. So for comparison, in terms of sizes, barely fit it. So the last Moreau in my collection currently <laughs> is this MM Open Tote one. It's also from the Brigands Online and I just got this. That's why I still have the care card here, but it's also convenient because then I can check the details. This is in the Passion colorway, so it's similar to my mini and it is made out of bull skin. So both the exterior and the interior are both made out of bull skin. So in terms of dimensions, this is 31 centimeters by 38 centimeters and 17 centimeters. So just like the other ones, this has a detachable um, pouch. Close. And for comparison, I, I can't I can't fit. <laughs> so this is the PM zip and this is the MM and it's an open tote. Against the mini. It's like this. So same features as the other ones. You can retract the handle if you want to and um, fold it. But you know, I, I display all of them and I just, I, I like the expanded look. So I do try to store them that way. So these two are new additions to my collection, but I have used this one, the PM Zip and the, one of the minis quite extensively. And I do, I do like them. They are, lightweight for what they are. They are 
but you know these bags are full leather bags so you would expect that they would have some weight to them they do but they're not as heavy as you would think and they can you know you can put a lot of things in them certainly when i used this over the weekend i placed a lot of documents in there and they were all fine for this one i, I wanted i wanted to show you just how much you can put in this although i should probably do a dedicated video on what fits in these bags but just for just for reference i have this big book here which look if it's all right and you'd still have a lot of space in it so let's close it Ta -da! you can really put a lot of things in it and you know, no doubt, once you get your hands on any Moreau bags, you will be able to tell how amazing the craftsmanship is. And you know, the kind of attention that they give to the bags, the, the stitchings, the stitching is really impeccable. The quality of the bag is phenomenal. So yeah, it's worth getting, it's worth considering. And I highly, highly recommend that you go check out their website because I think there's an option for you to actually design your own, your own bag or at least, you know, design your, your colorway. So each bag comes in this beautiful velvet dust bag with the Moro logo and it's velvet all the way. Before I end this video, I wanted to just mention that I get my Moro bags from First Curated. They're a Philippine-based online company and I will leave their details down below. They have a lot of really good deals on a lot of really great brands. So yeah, if you're interested, I'm going to leave their website and their Instagram account below. If you enjoyed this video, please consider giving it a thumbs up and please also consider subscribing to my channel. I'm sorry about the rain. Um, if you're in the Philippines or if you're in the zone, I hope we're keeping safe and dry. Thank you and see you in my next video. Bye!